for the CME on critical care facets to ponder. So we will be talking around a topic which always gives us new opportunities to learn that is sepsis. ILS Hospital Agartala which is a part of ILS group of hospitals. We are the fourth among the four hospitals that we have under the ambit of ILS hospitals. On behalf of the whole ILS hospitals family, I welcome you all once again to this uh, Garnery program on uh, intensive care, critical care. The topic being a few facets to ponder. As Dr. Paramita said, the major chunk will be about sepsis. Gives me immense pleasure to stand before you uh, on this auspicious day when we are about to begin a new era in the medical education in the state of Tripura. So to felicitate Dr. Om Tatiya sir, I will call upon stage. Also have the de-resuscitation and like de-escalation of antibiotics. BP should be more than 90 by 60. In that case, most of the time sepsis induced hypotensive shock. Patient will patient came uh, generally. So, thank you for the points. Your good points. Last couple of years, the Klebsiella is more common than a Pseudomonas nasinotobacter and the carbapenem is producing Klebsiella is really the problem. As you all are aware that sepsis is a major healthcare problem throughout the world, not only of our country, not only of this state, but everyone encounters sepsis in, in their day-to-day -day practice. And as you know that World Health Organization has already concerned about the antimicrobial resistance and sepsis is now is the third major cause of death worldwide. So vasopressors are, de uh, are defined as the drugs which increase the, intra the arterial pressure via peripheral vasoconstriction of the blood vessels which increase the SBR resulting in increase in the blood pressure.